bad, mate. That Not is bad. a bloody river. Brumbies over here. Yeah. The Brumbies. Got some ravens having a go at Matsy. Yeah. Time to keep it down. Still haven't got these on my feet though, have <laughs> <Yeah>. I? <laughs> Been walking for about like about four and a half k's or so and there's definitely a lot less snow than we were expecting. <laughs> There's snow everywhere else except for where we're walking. So we've been carrying these bloody things for 5Ks and paid about 120 bucks to hire them. I haven't even used them yet. Oh man, not complaining. <laughs> not, I'll carry seven of these yeah. if it means I get to come out here. Oh, so nice though. Eh? And the weather's uh, actually been on our side. Um, the weather report for this weekend was looking pretty hairy, but mate, if it stays like this, we will be a pretty happy camper. So we do it. You first, mate. I'm professional, mate. Don't worry about that. <laughs> Not even entirely sure this one's on properly, but <laughs> here we go. We're on. Yeah, I think. Let's do it. Here we go. <laughs> Down pending death. Oh shit, man! I'm just going. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> You're not meant to be oh. <laughs> They're not skis, mate. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Mom, I'm stuck! <laughs> I don't think that's how you do it. <laughs> That's how you get halfway down here. Graceful mate, graceful. It's actually a bit steep, eh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh mate. I tricked that one, didn't I? <laughs> oh buddy hell. Can you tell we're rookies? <laughs> That is not how you meant to do it, bloody hell. <laughs> I was laughing at you and I think I did a worse job than you, mate. <laughs> this guy reckons he saw an emu. So I think he's out there trying to find the tracks. How'd you go, David Adbra? Did you get the emu? Mate, it's an emu. <laughs> you reckon? <laughs> Wait till I show you these footprints. Show us it's not a pigeon? It looks like a dinosaur. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'll take your word for it, mate. What was that? Just as I was starting to think I was losing my mind. I think I you did, mate. Track and I was like, wow. Yeah. So there's a full track over there. Sorry? There's a, a definite em, like emu track over there. No. I took some photos to show you, but what? Yeah, we'll have a look in a bit. Head over that way later. Yeah. That's pretty cool. You saw an emu out here. I was starting to think I was tripping. Yeah. <laughs> it's all those mushrooms you ate on the walk in, mate. Let's see if I can show you the. Uh, you see that? Oh yeah. Yep, I think that's a pigeon. Pigeon? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, that's pretty sick. Oh wow, it's huge, eh? Yeah. That's really cool. Crazy. That's sick. So I think we found a pretty, pretty sweet little spot up here on top of this hill um, to probably camp. There's Heaps of trees around because we've got the tarp and bivy with us this trip, so no tent, so we kind of rely on some trees. And um, up here it's pretty nice, so like looking down the valley and there's some snow around here as well. And yeah, Matty thinks he just saw an emu, but uh, <laughs> it's 
So it could be a pretty nice spot for camp. But we're pretty bugged. I think it's what, like maybe nearly two o'clock, I reckon. I'll tell um, you what it is. 2.30. 2.30, there you go. So, I don't know. I think we probably will yeah, pull up stumps here. We've got a, a nice pie from Jindabyne Bakery to chow into, which I'm very keen for. Doesn't get much better than a pie and a, a Powerade for once, so. I can't believe that sun's out as well. There's actually quite a fair bit of um, blue sky. God, and yeah, the weather report wasn't very promising for today, so this is good. What do you got a quiche? Um, I ate the quiche. I've got a chicken pie over here. Oh, held up. Held up okay-ish. <laughs> <laughs> Um, a bit deformed, but... No, oh, mate, I'll take it. What a day it's been already. It's good. This is your first snow camp, eh? This is my first, first snow, snow trip. Camp. You yeah. saw an emu on your first snow camp. That's pretty good. An emu on top of a mountain oh, no. in the snow. In a beautiful valley, bloody hell. <laughs> we were sort of slugging it up that hill. Yeah. Heads down, just couldn't wait to get up. And I looked up, and I thought it was a hiker. And then it did like, as if it took off at pace and the head sort of swayed oh, yeah. back. And I was like, Whoa, what the hell is that? Yeah. I was like, oh, it's an e Yelling out, oh, I just saw an emu. And like, as soon as I said it, I was like, would there be an emu up here? <laughs> yeah. Is that a bit weird? But yeah, seen the prince. Delirious again. Yeah. Dehydrated. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that sun is absolutely gorgeous. Oh, so glad. It's actually turned out to be a really nice day. So I really didn't think it was gonna be. I thought it was gonna be pretty horrible, so. Yeah, it's really nice. Let's go for a bit of a wander around. Just have a look at the area. Um, seems like a pretty spot for choice in terms of spots to set up the old tarp shoulder. There's lots of trees around and stuff and some nice little areas, but let's go for a bit of a wander around and see what we can find. These big footprints just here. We think this is probably Matsy's emu. It's got a massive stride on it. Right off into the distance. Man, what a spot. It's pretty cool to think about, but like that emu was just up here, right? Eh? Yeah. So he would just been sitting up here just like doing his everyday life, just walking around. Yeah, like, what a nice yeah. view. And then some idiot with a moustache comes walking up the hill and scares him away. <laughs> <laughs> it's so cool to think though, like that those animals like that are just sitting out here just living their life every day. I'm jealous. Alright, well, I think this is going to be camp for tonight. We've uh, had a good wander around, but this is a pretty nice little protected spot up here, and you've got a, a really nice view of the mountains behind us as well. So, I think Max is going to do a little plow point off this tree here, and I'm probably going to do a, a gun near shelter just out here. Because, like I said, we didn't bring any um, yeah, tents for this trip. We decided to give the old tarp and bivy a crack out in the snow. So, hopefully, we don't regret it. <laughs> Yeah, um, we'll get that set up. What's going on? <laughs> <laughs> on cue, mate. <laughs> <What's up? laughs> Very nice, mate. Just, Almost looks like you've done this before. Just blizzard proof in this bad blizzard boy, hey. <laughs> <laughs> blizzard proof. 
and Amy approved. <laughs> this is like sandcastles for adults. Yeah. I know. <laughs> And just inside the shots, I'm just going to use a Corinthia XP2 BV. So I've just got the um, XPED closed cell mat just to give me some insulation from the ground. And unfortunately, I've still got my Nemo tensor, which is still deflating, but I tried to buy um, a Cedar Summit Ether Light XT insulated mat this week, but um, Everywhere I looked, they were all sold out. I went to the place in Jindabyne on the way here to have a look there and they were sold out as well. So, unfortunately, just gonna have to deal with this for the moment. Unless Matt's is so kind enough to give me his sleeping mat for tonight. No chance, mate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I roughly went up out of some, uh, some leaves, mate. Yeah, a bushcraft one. And just for the quilt today, I've just got the Cedar Summit Ember 3 quilt. I think it's rated to minus 10, I believe. So it should keep me pretty toasty for tonight. All right, well, camp's all set up. So like I said, I'm just rocking the Gunya shelter. If you guys want to see a bit more of a, a detailed video of how to set that up, then go to my uh, five top shelter video. I'll pop a link in the description below if you guys want to have a look at it, because it's a really a handy shelter, this one. And then Matt's is just rocking the plow point for tonight. Far out. Just have a go at it. What an absolute cracker of a spot. Oh, this place has definitely beat every expectation. And man, the weather this afternoon has just absolutely turned it on. This is really something special, eh? This is absolutely gorgeous. Of a cheers, you I think it is. <laughs> cheers. Cheers, mate. What an absolute cracker of an arvo. It's not get better. Honestly, oh yeah. the sky out here just feels so bloody big and beautiful. How's that? That is. <laughs> as big tell and you what, the rest that. of that's going in there. <laughs> <laughs> not that I can't handle it. I'm just here to enjoy myself, that's all. Mate, what an afternoon it has been out here. So good. When we rocked up in the car park, it was raining. raining yeah. It was raining. And that was it, that's all we had. As soon as we started walking, just happy days. The gods looked upon us and look what we were all with. Should we get some flames going? I think we probably should. I think so. It's gonna get dark and cold pretty quickly. That's it. We'll go enjoy the view from over there with the fire. <laughs>
All right, so for dinner tonight, just got one of these uh, campus pantry dehydrated meals. So no gin and tonic tonight. We're just gonna rock the old uh, cab Merlo. We should go down pretty well on a nice cold night like tonight. Backrest is pretty good. Yeah, this is a great idea. Oh yeah, not too bad. That's pretty nice. I think this is one of the only flavors I haven't tried now. Yeah, not not bad apart from the fact that I put way too much water in oh, this one. <laughs> yeah. Oh no. And it's couscous as well though. Ah uh, yeah. So it's just soggy True. couscous. Just, <laughs> just soggy couscous. At least it actually tastes like pork. Crows are noisy this morning. They really are. My feet are freezing. Well, good morning. Working to a nice little dusting of snow last night. The shelter's are looking right at home now. That was Matty's. <laughs> Mate, any, any more snow on that thing, <laughs> it'll just what, be on top of your face. What are you talking about, mate? That's bloody stable, as. <laughs> uh, not exactly how blizzard proof, is it? No. How'd you sleep? Mate, I was actually toasty, and toasty. I slept really well. I was right on the line of, um, if I was any warmer, I probably would have been uncomfortable. I was yeah. right. Any warmer, uncomfortable. Was, yeah, you know, I probably would have started sweating. <laughs> All right, that's uh, a I good problem to have out here, I think. Yeah. You'd rather be that than cold. I was not expecting that. Yeah, I slept pretty well. Um, just had to go up a few times to go to the toilet, which is never fun. But uh, yeah, a pretty nice night's sleep. My feet are bloody cold to this morning. Eh? Like My boots are pretty wet and the toes are very icy, so I'm gonna see how we go today. Mate, have a go at that thing. <laughs> <laughs> that is the most pitiful excuse for a shoulder. <laughs> oh, come on, mate. Oh, how's this guy, eh? Hey? Look at this Actually. thing, mate. Now that is, it's like a stealth bomber. Look at the lines on that thing, mate. It's, that could handle a yeah. blizzard for sure. Yeah, stealth bomb. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, good songs. Man, these ravens are going off their head, eh? They've just been non-stop talking all morning and yesterday as well. There's so many ravens around here. I wonder what they're saying. They're probably like, who the hell is this guy in our backcountry? <laughs> but um, the sun's just starting to poke its head out now, man. It is such a beautiful morning out here. Like, oh, I cannot stress enough how bloody gorgeous is camping in the snow. I'm so glad I got into it this year. This is my second snow camp and, oh, Next year, I'm going to try and get down here as much as I can, eh? It's just so beautiful and peaceful, especially um, having this sort of fresh uh, coat of snow over everything. It's really, really nice.
Well, good to see you, Matsy. Got the fire going for us. Hey, yeah, boys <laughs> and girls. And girls. <laughs> Time for some brekkie, I reckon. That's it. Before, mate. I have not. To me, it just seems like a way to watch, watch and learn. What? Have you done it? No. <laughs> <laughs> to me, it just looks like it's going to take like ages for it to cook. Do I look like I've done this before? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> looks like the bottom's just going to get burnt and the top's going to be raw. To the untrained <laughs> eye, this might look like a bad idea, but. <laughs> Tell you what, it won't work if the fire's not going. <laughs> oh, <my. laughs> oh, you Your lost body his in this fella. <laughs> oh, mate, you're killing it. You're absolutely killing it. Play, cue, cue sad music. He's lost, he's this lost guy, the best, mate, best part of the bacon. <laughs> right down there. Fell in. Is what it is. The other one's about to go too. Mate, the other one's... Burning and about oh, to fall. Third one's out to go. Oh. <laughs> I actually don't like those pieces. So. <laughs> I'm more of a rind kind of kind of bloke. Look at this. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> oh, mate! Look at that one. Mate, people have a go at me for burning my food. <laughs> Look at that thing. <laughs> He's just about ready now, another couple of minutes. <laughs> yeah. How's that cancer tasting? Just how I like it, crunchy. <laughs> I can't believe people have a go at me for burning my food. I think we've got a new, new winner here, right here. Far out, that thing is on fire. I just gotta lay this on, <laughs> on the fire itself. <laughs> I don't know where to go from here. <laughs> Cut that bit off, they're good. Yeah, they're good, <laughs> <laughs> they're good. Yeah, it's good. <laughs> Matty, do you want to see how a real boy cooks bacon? Come over here, mate. <laughs> what do you reckon, though, about that one, boys and girls? All right, so get some nice sourdough here. Just cut this in half. So just in here, we've just got some sweet baby ray sauce. This stuff is so good. That is a breakfast of champions. And much better than Matsy's. <laughs> well, before I pull this down, I'm gonna give you guys a quick little look around. The old uh, gun in your shelter held up pretty nicely last night. Still standing, which is good. As for Matsy's plow point, I think it's uh, turned more into a bit of a, a water catchment device than a, a shelter, but... That's what it is. <laughs> oh, right. So, need some water, I was, conf I was confused, I thought it was, um, yeah. yeah, shelter, but no, sorry, no, sorry, no, sorry, mate. Don't surprise me. You, 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 <laughs> so. you ever seen one of these before? Nah. Yeah, 
Let's just walk in the t-shirt today, eh? So warm. It just spun as soon as it like left my arm. Oh, oh man, I would have felt so man. terrible. <laughs> Crumped under the weight of my hand. I'll pretend to catch it. Yeah. Oh, sorry mate. Yeah. Fill in. <laughs> this this way, just go yeah. down. Yeah. That's, that was more successful. Some weather moving in, the wind started to pick up now, and I think there was some forecast for some thunderstorms a bit later today, so this could be it. Alright, legends, well, that rain started to move in now, it started to, yeah rain slash snow so it's probably about a good as time as any to yeah, call it quits. Unfortunately we didn't get to spend another night out here. It would have been nice but we had such a, a good day yesterday like that sunset last night and just this morning like special. You couldn't have asked for something better. It was so so good. So yeah it's been a really good trip. It's been so good getting Matty out here and doing your first snow camp. That's it mate. Enjoyed it? Yeah mate. Yeah, mate. I mean he introduced me to the snow and uh, like I guess I showed you how to cook bacon properly so and set up a terrible shelter yes oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, man next year gosh so keen to get a few more snow trips in eh? yeah absolutely yeah. man this wish it wasn't a six hour drive it'd be nice if it was just a few hours but oh well. anyway um yeah i want to say massive thanks to all you guys watching and i'll see you guys in the next one Hooroo. you